Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is game number 32. On the tee from Poland, Adrian Moronk. Well, he's having a cracking season. He's 15th on the DP World Tour rankings. There are many people who believe a win is not too far away for this man. No shortage of power there, is there? Tim Barter is following this pairing. Yeah, good afternoon, everyone. A beautiful, blustery day out here on a great golf course, so this is going to be fun to watch. Not fun for Adrian at the first, though. 193 to go. fortunate that one well it's a good par in the end never touched the fairway bunker off the tee then pulled it left got a bit of a lucky break <coughs> pitched it to there so scorecard paints no pictures 61 play more like 180 so between a 7-iron saw this the other day and this ball could carry on for quite some distance down the path <coughs> yeah taking relief from the cart path here and dropped in the rough behind Green's fully six, seven feet above him. Quite a lot of green to work with, back into a little bit of breeze too. Well, that's what happens with these sandy lies. If you don't quite get the ball clean, get a bit of sand between the club head and the ball, it goes absolutely nowhere. Morocco's third, fourth, I beg your pardon now, the second. Toe of the club, that was not the, his best one by a long way. Adrian Moronk then a lengthy bogey putt here at the second, left to right break up. Little change in elevation there. Yeah, that's going to hurt a little bit, but it 219 yards into a freshening right to, light, right to left breeze. Right yeah. Tucked oh. over on the left, oh. two bunkers oh. left oh. to be avoided. Oh. That must be one of the best shots of the day. Yes, I agree. But there is enough right to left in this to make it interesting. Deserved a two and got a two. That yep. was a great birdie. It was. That'll settle him down a little bit now. Adrian Moronk. <coughs> well, he's played the par fives well in. And this to get back to all square on the day. Yeah, just a hint of right to left in it. Driving a six iron or three wood six iron into this par five, so big hitting. Yeah, this time really well hold. So a good recovery. To back birdies. Stand on the back. Up to the eighth. Moronk. It's been a popular spot down there, now, isn't it? It is a slow one up to the hole from there. Swing grip for Poland's Adrian Moronk. And it's worked very effectively. It's a birdie. That's three in a row for Moronk. So he's moved it to nine under. 
Moronk into the back nine. Yeah, that's okay down the right side there. It won't reappear. It's quite a steep slope in front of him, but... Moronk, second shot, 210. This flag cut on top of a little mound. Really difficult to get close to. Just on the front edge again, a wedge shot that comes up a little bit short. Moronk came up just a little bit shy of the 10th green with his pitch shot. Up a little ridge and then turning at the top. Oh, great part. Yes. Awesome. Awesome stuff. Laronk takes the lead. Yeah, 228 yards to go to a back left pin. Very much on a, an upslope here, a real launch pad. Wind off the left hand side. And sometimes on an upslope, you can't clear your left hip. You whip the hands over. The ball can go left, and you do not want to miss this green right. long and left. And it's heading left as well. People ducking all over the place. Potential problems for Moronk. So no formality, but very fortunate. I don't think he got the connection he was hoping for on that one. I'm not sure whether it's made it into that green side bunker. No, not quite made it in. Really poor strike. Awful. Moronk's fourth now at 12. Yeah, ball well below his feet, and so the contour of the green makes this difficult as well. It's tilted away and left to right, downhill. Joanna, who is feeling every shot with her boy today. Well, she's not going to be happy with that. And neither is he. Let's think that is wet. Moronk had the option to go forward to a drop zone about halfway down the hole, but he's chosen to tee it up on the game, same teeing ground as he was. <coughs> Would have been a horrible ridge. shot, Tim, wouldn't it, from the, the drop zone? Yeah, absolutely, Mark. Yeah, fiddly yardy. So he's done the right thing there. <laughs> well, all sorts of trouble from a rock. Players get used to greens tilting from back to front. So when you put from the left of the pin, you expect it to break left to right. This one actually goes the other way. I think it's quite tricky to read. Well, 149 yards to the flag. You walk off with six. Three shots gone. Very silent walk to the 18th team. Moronk, the old brain will be a little scramble after that last hole. Six there, but himself together, he did a good tee shot there. Adrian Moronk second shot then into this par 5 18th, 232 yards but playing nothing like it because it's very much downwind and that wind has picked up again to 15, 18 miles an hour. Water waiting left and short if the contact isn't great. This could be as little as a 6 iron, certainly a 5. amazing game. We go from a, a, a very poor wedge shot and a triple bogey to the best shot into 18 of the whole day. What a shame. He really deserved that. It is a birdie to finish from a wrong 17th. Well, he's going to rue that for some time. Still in it. Still got a great chance of his first win tomorrow.
description of the DP World Tour video, click here, and to subscribe, click here.